Hello everyone! So glad this video finally worked. It was so frustrating last time. And like I finally got over that awkward fear of seeing yourself in the computer screen and then virtually just talking to yourself while you're sitting in a room alone. But now that I'm over that fear and it finally works this time, hello everyone! Hope you're doing great. Um, first of all, thank you very much for all your responses on Facebook and emails. It's been very helpful for me um, just to be communicating with y'all and getting all that information in place. Um, it's also helped me kind of figure out um, what ideas or events to send y'all that y'all might be interested in while being here on your internship experience. So, um, housing, thank you also for sending me all that housing information. For those who are having problems communicating with the village apartments, um, I did talk with Christine today and they said they've been a little short staffed so she should get back to you either today or Monday with information and registration forms etc etc so um, I believe Miss Hannah asked who the client was and I'm actually not allowed to tell you all that but I can give you all a clue um, it's gonna be awesome so but really y'all have a lot of fun and y'all should be excited and figure are finding out who that's going to be. So, let's see what else do I have on the agenda. Yes, eating ideas. Um, I suggest so you don't have to eat out three times a day. Um, maybe going to Walmart or Super Saver here and just getting food for your apartments because you'll all have refrigerators and microwaves and stuff and so you could probably just eat like a breakfast is pretty easy to make in your apartment obviously so make that before you come here and then we have a kitchen so you can either eat in or go out to eat downtown and I have um, attached a PDF and I'll put it on the Facebook site too of um, places you can eat downtown and what's cool about the PDF if you click on the links it'll either go to their website or to Google Maps and it'll show you where it is so check that out there's also other information on there like the Selleck Dining Hall, which is our on-campus cafeteria, and then um, just other things to do in Lincoln that are pretty cool. So there's that, and for apparel purposes, um, if you are wondering, I guess, how to dress here, um, it's pretty diverse. Um, obviously, you don't want to show up in, like, torn jeans and flip-flops, but, you know, you could be your classy self. But last year girls wore like heels or flats and nice jeans or nice pants and a uh, nice top. And then guys did like khakis and button down shirts or polos. Um, they also had a bow tie day, which that was either Wednesday or Thursday, but anyway. Um, but however you dress, just make sure you're portraying yourself in a way that you would want the business world to see you. So hopefully that's classy and not trashy, but um, yeah, just be yourself. Oh, excuse me about that. Um, be yourself and confidence speaks volumes and everyone looks great with a smile so see it's just wonderful but um yeah um I'd probably suggest bringing the sweater also because even though it's probably gonna be blazing hot outside and super humid it does get really cold here so yes that's about all I have for this video Sorry, it was a lot longer than I thought it was going to be, so I didn't have time to go over all the fun adventures that y'all could have here, but I will post those on the email and on the Facebook group. Um, there's stuff like concert series and different trails and different, um, not marathons, oh yeah, marathons and 5K runs and stuff like that, farmer's market, so things that y'all had suggested that you like to do in the summer. But, okay, you guys are awesome. Thank you for watching, and if you have any other questions, you know who to ask, and I hope you're having a great day, and I will talk to you all soon. Bye.